Mr. Money in the Bank. The following contest is a tag team championship first round match. And from parts unknown, weighing in at 266 pounds, he is Mr. Money in the Bank and one half of the Global Fighting Champions, Slater. Mr. Money in the Bank. And from the pits of hell, weighing in at 242 pounds, he is Mr. Money in the Bank and one half of the Continental Dragon Hardcore Champions, The Nightmare. Michigan, weighing in at 220 pounds, he is Mr. Money in the Bank and one half of the Classic Dragon Champions, El Jefe Ashley Smash Williams. And from Switzerland, weighing in at 220 pounds, one half of the classic super smooth hero, the prodigy, Jimmy. Byron, how big is this match for these two teams here tonight? Well, Michael, the tag team division is white hot right now. So while a win will obviously be huge, I can tell you that a loss would be absolutely devastating. Given the competition right now, a loss tonight would be a huge setback. And it looks like it'll be these two superstars kicking it off here tonight. All the budding tag teams out there wow. hoping to one day make it to the big stage. Better be watching this match with a notepad in hand because you can bet this is going to be a lesson in how it's done. We know what's coming here. Wow, he got out of it. Yeah, I'm not so sure he had it fully locked in. Mm. 
He stalked in his opponent from the top turnbuckle. He's on the defensive here. This tag team match can get out of hand quickly if he doesn't mount an offense soon. This thing appears to be slipping away from him in a hurry, guys. And you can bet he envisioned things going much. During the rivalry between the Hardy Boys and Cesaro and Sheamus over the Raw Tag Team Championship, the teams became very familiar with one another. In June of 2017, the teams met in a two out of three falls bout on Monday Night Raw. The most important fall in a two out of three falls contest is the first fall. If a team can win the first fall, that sets the tone for the rest of the match and your opponents are playing catch up. The two out of three falls match that saw the Hardy Boys go at it with Cesaro and Sheamus was a throwback of sorts. Throughout the 1960s and 70s, championship title defenses and grudge matches were often decided in the two out of three falls format. Cesaro and Sheamus didn't waste any time and scored the decisive first fall after a broke kick rocked Jeff Hardy. Cesaro and Sheamus wanted to continue their domination of Team Extreme, but the Hardys had other ideas as Matt tied things up at one fall apiece after a twist of fate on the Swiss sideboard. After a swanton bomb by Jeff Hardy, the match broke down and the third fall was ruled a double countout. There have been times in sports entertainment when unlikely duos have formed and over time they develop and bond and become an outstanding tag team combination. The team that immediately... He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. Oh, schoolboy! Oh, Shoulders oh. down here! Beautiful technique. Well, I don't think anyone thought Cesaro and Sheamus would develop into a premier tag team. Over time, the superstars realized that they were better as allies than as enemies. And when they combine their incredible strength, the results were something that couldn't be ignored. It was really unbelievable to witness the evolution of Cesaro and Sheamus as a team. We saw them improve every week in this coach. I'm not sure how much he has left. His shoulders are down. Digging deep for a kick out. Still a lot more fight left. Over the last few years, the tag team scene in WWE is hotter than it's ever been. One of the teams that has shined brighter than any other is the New Day. Xavier Woods, Big E, and Kofi Kingston are two-time tag team champions. But it was their second reign that put the New Day name in WWE history books forever. Tagged in. The tag team competition right now is as heated as it's ever been since the Attitude Era. Everywhere you look, there's another tremendous tag team combination. Looking to make a run at the WWE Tag Team Bowl. When we talk about the New Day, the team won a fatal four-way match in their second tag team title reign in 2015's SummerSlam. It's like a bag of rotting garbage. And that Woods, Kingston, and Big E are idiots. But I'll give the New Day this. They're one of the greatest tag teams ever. He might have it. When a superstar is in a tag team match and has endured heavy amounts of punishment, they must find a way back to their corner to tap. He fights his way free. But how much energy did he exhaust? You're a Nagi. Man, oh man. He's in control now. Absolutely punishing. Corey, you touched on this before. Part of a tag team's ability to be successful is their ability to endure punishment and make their way to their partner when they need to tag out. One way to do that is to create that separation you spoke of so they have some space to gather themselves and time to make their way back to the corner. You're absolutely right, Michael. What's the use of having a tag team partner if you're not able to get to them when you got to tag out of the match? Getting that separation is key in breaking any momentum. Little underhook applied. Face buster! There it is. Shoulders on the mat. He kicks out before three. Gonna take more than that. Axe handle finds its target. Versus it. 
Ooh, what impact. When this guy's on, Ouch. look out. Oh, brutal. He's back in control here. Going for the cover. And he breaks up the pinfall. I don't think there are two teams I'd rather see square off against each other right now. This is amazing. Uh, going to the top, high risk. Comes up big with the reversal. The tag team scene here in WWE is undergoing a bit of a renaissance, and it's because of that. Dropped, and that was a hard shot, Corey. Yeah, you might want to think about throwing in the towel at this point. Oh, my goodness, this hurts. Oh! Comes in off the tag. And there's his speed paying off. Tagged in. Another great tag team match here tonight. I don't think the tag team scene has ever been hotter here in WWE. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Setting up. to the back. This could be all she wrote. Slam with authority. He's in complete control now. The shoulders are down. Yeah, he's got a lot left in him. Have to put in a little more work than that. Cross the shoulders. Samoan driver. This match might be over, guys. Can you believe this battle's not over yet? Not yet. <laughs> when this guy's on, look out. Going for it all here. You gotta believe this one's over. But is it enough to end it? Tagged in. What a splash! He may very well have run out of gas. He needs to find a way to create some space or else this thing's over. I'm not used to seeing this. Let's remember though, guys, his opponent doesn't seem to be in great shape either. Now the old vicious head crank. Look at the torque. So much damage to the neck. Comes in off the tag. He knows he's in trouble. That should do it. Got the shoulders down. He breaks the pin. And look at the suplex. What a match this has been, guys, and it's starting to look like these super Incredible impact! Can he finish the job? No question, he's feeling invincible right now. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Harsh impact! A lot of pride on the line.